So now I have another reason to be pissed off. I completely forgot to be looking at my camera while recording. So I forgot to record about three minutes or so of the game. Actually, I don't know if it was three minutes. It, it could have been less, but I missed a good bit. So I don't know what y'all saw and what y'all didn't see. But during this battle, Slugma used Overheat and knocked out Lil Weezy. And he had maybe three-fourths to four-fifths three fourths to four fifths of his health and he got knocked out from an overheat um so that's basically the only thing other than that we won all the battles and yada 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 and now this guy um you know he uh So what is that? No! Oh my god. See, I, I was about to go into, out into Robin Hood, but I completely forgot I'm in a fire gym. So, don't want any of that. Just gonna go for a brave bird. Okay, that didn't do much at all. Transform into the flying tight. It's perfectly fine with me. I'm gonna go for a quick attack. Should knock out the Kecleon. Should. And it doesn't. Fire Punch. Fire Punch is the move he has. Please do not knock it out. Okay, quick attack, quick attack, knock it out, get out, quick. We already lost one Pokemon, we don't need to lose all of the other ones. Okay, Porky grew to level 27. So that's a positive. Man, just... Knocked out Lil Weezy. Right when we were, you know, doing decent, we had a pretty decently good team going on. That happens. Oh well. Please, do not battle me. You... You must be getting tired by now. Yes, I am. I'm tired of battling trainers. I just want to play, face the gym leader and be done with this gym. That's all I want to do. That's all I want to do. That's all I want to do. I don't want to battle you and your stupid Numel. I want to battle Flannery, beat the gym, and get the hell out of here. So, let's go for a Zen Headbutt. I know I'm not a good attacker. But I just want to see how much it does. Not another overheat. Not another overheat. Not another overheat. Oh my god. Thank god. I think I actually have pretty good special defense. I must if that's what it did. But um, thank god. Yes, I've been this a lot more. Earth power. Shouldn't do too much either. Yeah, I must be very special in defense. I know I have a pretty decent special attack. Because I've been wrecking with the side beam. And I think it's also modest or timid or one of the two. So I think it's modest. Let me double check. I know it's thick fat too, so that really comes in handy. Uh, it's modest, yes. Good special attack, shitty attack. Okay, we're, I think we're about to face the gym leader. So let's heal Porky. And I think this is the one you have to go to. I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure. Pretty, pretty sure. And it is. <sighs> so let's face her. It's all or nothing.
She's she. Jeez, calm the hell down, Flannery. Welcome. No way! I mean, beauty trainer, you've done well to make it this far. Hope I'm not like busting out speakers. <laughs> Let's see. I I'm uh, honored to be serving as the gym leader of. No, I mean I'm Flannery, and I'm in charge here. Uh, you better not estimate me, cause. I've only been in leader short time. With the skills inherited from my grandfather, I'm gonna demonstrate the hot moves we've owned in this land. <sighs> yeah! Yeah, um... <laughs> cause I, I know because I'm kind of far away from the mic that, um... May not be that loud, but uh, I hope I didn't bust anyone's speakers for that, because that was uh, was not expecting to be yelling for a person. But let's side beam the slugma. Let's try to make some quick work. Oh man, and we almost oko the slugma. Oh, he's gonna go for light screen. She's setting up. She's setting up. You know what? I don't give two shits about your life. Oh my god. Fuck you, Flannery. You and your hyper potions. Oh my god. That, that, yeah, that like cuts it in half. Shit. Yeah, that's how much it did. Yeah, it, yeah, it does cut in half. That's true. Sunny day. Oh my god. This slugma is setting up. This slugma is setting up like crazy right now. Holy cow. Holy cow. She is not messing around. She's setting up light screen, sunny day. Mm, this is kind of scary. A Torkoal. Uh, I'm going to stay in. Level 28. Okay, I'm still within, you know, that, that level range. You know, give or take one or, one or two. One less isn't too bad. Two less can be... Oh, shit. Oh, it's going for curse. Oh, my God. She is setting up like crazy. It's nobody's business. Attack rows, defense rows. Light stream, we're off. Let's go for... Should I go for a confuse ray or should I just go for this? Let's just go for the side beam. Let's get a good bit of damage on the circle. Let's see what she's going to go for. Another curse. Ooh. Man. I'm like really nervous right now. Uh, I mean, I do have thick fat, but then again, I don't, th I don't know if she has anything physical, fire-wise on Torkoal. He may have something else, but I don't know what he would have. Bop! Ooh, yeah, that would, that would about do it. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god, dude. Like, I feel like really sick right now. Because, like, I keep doing this thing where it's like, I can prevent it. But at the same time, I don't want another Pokemon to go down from it. So I'm just like, let's just see what happens type of thing. And that's not the way I should be playing this. I should have just gone into Maki because he probably would have been able to eat it up. Because he's bulky. Spoink is psychic. He already doesn't have shit. He already has a shitty defense. Most psychic Pokemon don't have defense. Special defense maybe, but nothing else going for them. So, pretty much that whole grinding session, trying to level up both Lil Weezy and Porky, has already been wasted. Man, like, Porky was actually getting useful. 
he was useful because all my other Pokemons are physical. I had a special attacker for for once. Um, same thing with Lil Weezy, also special attacking. Um, was pretty bulky, but was a terrible, terrible trainer. But we Oko the Numel. Now we're back to our original three Pokemon that we had for a good while. Um, trying to think where we could find some more Pokemon at that we haven't already. I guess I was trying too hard. Why am I even doing your voice? You go to Pokemon. I've only recently become a gym leader. I guess I was trying too hard to be someone I'm not. When I don't act like myself, no one in Pokemon that I battle at my side get confused. Thank you for teaching me that. You deserve this. Badge won't bring Porky back. If you have a Heat Badge, all Pokemon up to level 50, even those you get in trades from other people will obey you completely. And it lets Pokemon use the HM move Strength outside of battle. This is a token of my appreciation. Don't be shy about taking it. Overheat. 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 Overheat is a fire type move that inflicts serious damage on the target. But it also sharply cuts the special attack of the Pokemon using it. It might not be suitable for longer battles. Don't tell me I have to go all the way through. Or was there another way I can exit? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. There had to be another way. There was no way. Um, yeah, okay, good. This, no, okay, okay, okay. I see. Okay, well, that was depressing. Exciting and depressing. No, I am not battling you, May. Get the hell out, please. CS3 Wild, it's a relief to see you in one piece. Oh, well, you know, the last time I saw you was right after battling those Team What's It people. Why they just can't see the mag and Aqua? Why? So I was a bit worried, thinking about what might have happened to you after that, CNS3. What, you battled them again after that? And you beat them? You really are something else, CNS3. I, I mean, you and your team are... I'm, I'm pretty impressed by you all. And that pretty stone that's sparkling there, is that the meteorite you got back from them? Oh, that's right. Here, here. I've been thinking about giving these to you. The Go Goggles. Now we can actually... Might say that for next episode, though. If you put on those go goggles, you'll you'll all blah, 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 you'll be all set heading into the desert on Route 111. Oh, and isn't that the Lava Ridge Gym badge? So you beat Flannery too? I guess you really are training your Pokemon right. No, most of them keep dying, but you know. Next up, we'll be challenging your dad Norman in Petalburg, right? I'm heading to Petalburg Gym next myself. Do you want to go back together, back to Petalburg? No, not yet, because I want a Pokemon. From round 11. So, shoot. Well, I'll still be here in Lava Ridge for a while, so find me if you think you'd like to be a little comfy on the road after all. Okay, so that's actually really cool. She'll stay here until we're ready. So, that means we can actually go on Route 111, do some stuff, and then head back to Power Work. So, but I think I will save that for the next episode. Even though the void in my heart wants to capture more, to fill the void of Louisie and Porky, who will join the rest of their fallen comrades in battle. Um, man, you know what's sad? We have more Pokemon in the grave than we do in our box. We have one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm so crap at this. But on the bright side, we'll be able to go into Route 111 on uh, in the desert and catch another Pokemon. Uh, on the next episode, uh, I'm debating if I want to bring Zubat with me or Wayne to replace Coughing. But it's also flying, and I don't want to bring another flying. 
I think you'll just have to stay for now. So, back to the original three. Peke, Makit, and uh, Robin Hood. So, hopefully next episode, I won't lose any more Pokemon. Because we've been losing Pokemon left and right lately. And it's really upsetting. It's very frustrating for me. I'm about to go cry again. Uh, <laughs> not that I really cried, but, you know, just kind of bummed. But, um, yeah. But if you still like the episode, please hit that like button. I'd really appreciate it. Um, also, leave a comment in the comment section down below if you have any comment, comments or suggestions. That was pretty redundant, but you know what I mean. You know what I'm saying. Uh, please do. I'd like to hear all feedback. So, I'll catch you guys next time. Thanks again for watching. See you in the studio shining out. Peace.